Hello, hello, hello. Ah, uh, what time is it? I can't even see it. It's, uh, I think it's three something in the morning. Let me walk around here. Oh, dirty trucking got some dirty shit been done in the back seat of this car. Uh, what time we got here? Dirty trucking is reporting this at, what is this? What does it say? 324. Okay. Explain the situation to you. Picked up two young girls a minute ago. Uh, one of them getting the seat on the uh, passenger side rear back seat. She gets in complaining about her butt's wet. The seat is extremely wet. So as you can see, I put that's how wet it is. I put paper down there and it's soaking the water up out the seat. Now I got to contact Uber because these this was a group of four. And I don't do front seat riding, but Uber doesn't have anything on the app to prevent you from ending up picking up more than you would ride. Uh, it don't let you know how many people come to the car. So this, this group, I ended up uh, driving all the way from Detroit out there to Macomb County at uh some like a little bar like on the dirt road off of off the highway up there and um uh, they were going to i got the address they were going up to harrison township um no the, the bar was in harrison township what the guy did he ended up scheduling a pickup for me to drive up there pick him up and take him and drop him off where he was at but he had the wrong address in there so we had to correct the address in route but um it was Two Caucasian, two white girls, and a white guy in the back, and a white guy up there in the front seat, in the passenger seat. So they riding, I done dropped him off. Um, the girls that got off on the rear driver's side back left the door open, so I had to call them back. Hey, you let one of y'all left the door open. She came back, sl slammed the door, sl closed the door, but it was the guy sitting on this side, sitting here. And I don't know if he had water in his hand or what the fuck he had in his hand. But this seat is extremely wet. All the way to, to red in here. It's wet. It's wet up here to red in here. Uh, I don't know if they had some water on them or what they had in their hand. Because they can't get in the car with alcohol. But the young lady I just dropped off here where I'm at sat in this and she had on a short one of those short skirts so her butt was red in it so now i'm gonna have to report it to uber that one of the passengers that recently got out the car got in here with something and they spilled it but the killing part i think they did it deliberate because this is harrison township where this happened at uh that is the same area where i had the problems with the two white dudes before wanted to call me a man and kept calling me a man when they got out the car and uh the conversation in here between them when they was in there all of a sudden uh, they started talking about the guy in the front seat asked the girl in the back Dude, what's the difference between cosmetology and dermatology it's just one has to do with hair and nails the other one skin but it was the way he got out the car when he when we got him, I got him to his location uh when he got out the car he turned to open the door and then he just raised his butt up real slow like he knew what this motherfucker in the back just did look at all that girl i just dropped off here just sat in that goddamn shit i don't know what the fuck is wrong with them them dudes the motherfuckers when i go out there i don't know what your fucking problem is but you don't do this type of shit other people get in this goddamn car you don't do this type of shit. Spill something in the goddamn seat. And then walk your ass out of here. Don't say nothing. And leave it there for another passenger to sit down on. When they get out of this car, I don't go in the back seat. I don't reach back there for nothing. I don't know anything happening back there until they tell me. And this girl, I picked her up at the club. It was her birthday. She got her outfit on. And she gets in this car and sat in that shit that the motherfuckers... Caucasians left in this goddamn car. Two white girls and a white dude was in the back seat. And the white dude was sitting at the door.
the two white girls was on my side. When they got out, she left the door. They walked off. He closed the door on his side. The two white girls get out on this side, left the door wide open. Now I see why. Look at that goddamn shit. I don't know what the fuck going on in Harrison Township, but I'm gonna peep the fucking shit that's going on in Harrison Township. That's the second time y'all done got in this goddamn car on that black shit playing like you ain't on that black shit. Now look what the fuck these motherfuckers done done. Now I got a call over. Ain't this a bitch? That's why I don't like going out there. I don't deal with that shit. You want to be ignorant? You got a problem? Don't call for Uber. Now, I don't know how they set that shit up because I ended up driving all the way from Detroit out there to pick them up. That was a long ride, 15 miles. Ain't nobody out there to pick them up. He had to sit up in the front seat. And I, that's why I don't like front seat riders. They, I got to hear that same speech when they get up in there. Uh, I don't bite. I don't give a fuck what you do. I don't want you up in this seat. Though I ain't tell them that. That's why I don't do front seat riders. Now look at this shit. Fucking pitiful. Some white dude I picked up with two Caucasian girls back here in Harrison Township did that. It was a group of four. Ain't this a bitch? You done spilled something in this seat and motherfuck, I hope it ain't piss. It don't look to be, be yellow. Look like some water or something he had that I didn't see when they got in the car. Ain't this a bitch? That's why you can't get in here with open beverages and liquor and shit. You're not, it don't smell like liquor. Now, that's the first thing I checked. It's, it seems to be like water. That's why you can't get in these cars with open beverages. I be telling them, take your bags, put the motherfucking shit in the goddamn trunk. Because these are cloth seats back here. People get in behind you. But I think these motherfuckers did that shit on purpose. I know damn well hell, this motherfucker didn't sit his ass back here. And all that wet shit while we was riding 15 miles to their location to get dropped off. I think when he got out the car, he did the motherfucker shit. I think he spilled it in the car when he got out. But I didn't see the shit because I don't think that motherfucker sat in that shit the whole fucking 15 miles from the time I picked him up. This dirty trucking at fucking Harrison Township out there in Macomb County. I don't know what the fuck wrong with y'all, but I'm gonna peep y'all. Now I got to report that shit. You gonna get a notification about this shit. You don't do no shit like this. You don't come in here and do no shit like this. Don't get in this goddamn car doing that goddamn shit. Out there wanting to call me a man. Now I got another group of four, four white individuals in the seat wet now. Ain't this a bitch? You think he sat there in the wet seat the whole ride? No, I don't think so. And if he did, he ain't say nothing. I think he may have got out the car and whatever he had in his hand, he turned around and poured it on the seat. Because I told you, the white chicks got on on the other side and left the door wide open. And they already made it to, they, to the side of their house. I had to call them back to the car. Hey, you left the door open. What the fuck?